Hello everybody, this is Carson is Awesome 642 and I am here today for the very first time at the at the Twin Cities Model Railroad Museum. It's about 49 minutes from college, but it's worth a lot. So over here is the entryway where you pay admission and stuff. And here Thomas the Tank Engine accepts donations. But that is one weird ass face. You can take two pictures for one book. Here we have some VHS tapes and magazines and stuff like that. Here's a train that looks here's the cyber shark made out of weapons. In fact, starting here is this Lego set here. Here we have the Southern Pacific, um, dressed as the American Freedom. And over here we have some stuff. The Hogwarts and Poor Express Trains. And you are allowed to press buttons. There's the little engine that could, complete with a circus. Now, let's take a look at this here. If we press this button, what happens? Ah, the trolley moves. All right, well, let's, let's make this train move there. These are some pretty neat, this is one neat layout, I have to admit. It's a good idea. Do you know that's how I feel? Like, yeah. I like pointing these two things and saying, I did that, I did that, I did that, I did that, I go to that, I go see John's trains, you know, and Michael did this or whatever. And, and I, just need I, was, I was looking forward to saying, this. <laughs> No, it's good. It's learning for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and I'm super yeah. AI. The rest of us, <laughs> we chip in and collaborate. Right. Uh, <laughs> yeah, but never. Well, we'll, 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 we'll. Suggestions are always welcome. Yeah. yeah. But no, he'll, 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 he'll say anything. He'll, like, he'll just build a better whatever. Right, whatever he wants. There's Paul Bunyan and Babe. <laughs> That was fast. You'll hear it from you. He just, he just like a All right. technique. This looks like Tid Mitchell's, yeah, only it's down. not. Here's the Disneyland Railroad. Oops. Well, that's the first layout anyways. And here's the little engine that could. Oh, this button operates the tilt-a-whirl. That's, that's pretty awesome. You can see the Hogwarts Express and the night bus. Very interesting. Well, that's the first layout anyways. Over here we have some miniature Legos of trains. And up here, we have a whole... We have a whole bunch of trains. We got a Great Northern, a steam and a diesel and Amtrak running all the way down there. Plus great pictures. There's the Hiawatha, the Burlington, freight trains, the Northern and Southern Pacifics. 
as the Burlington Brew began and the Chicago Northwestern. And over here, we have another layout. It appears to be a giant one, a G-scale. And it looks like the circus is on parade. Either that or Oktoberfest, considering the uh, guys playing later who's in there. This button here operates, or it should operate the trolley. Yeah, there it goes. Oh, it's Mr. Rogers' trolley. Okay, that's pretty awesome. All right, here's a lumber camp. A pretty giant lumber camp too, I might add. Oh, and if you look over here, there is a circus train. Emmett Kelly Jr. Circus. This is just the passenger side of things. The freight side is over here. Let's press the button and see what happens. And there it goes. All right. All right. All right. Over here is another, uh, circus slash thing, you know, and here it comes. And... It... All right, over here we have a wooden train down here from the Burlington route. And over here is uh, one of those trains that, that kind of has a tank for a tender instead of a, well, you get what I'm saying. All right, over here we have the Northern Pacific and Chicago Northwestern trains. Up here we have the Hiawatha and Burlington route again. Pennsylvania, Chicago, Burlington and Quincy, Duluth, some S gauge, Northern and American types, some Northern Pacific types, the Burlington Zephyr, and the St. Paul Pacific. Over here is another layout, manually operated. Hello. Here's a small freight train featuring... It's a small circus train, I'll, I'll give it that. Let's see what this button does. Yep, it operates the train. It's a rather small circus train, I'll give it that. And here we have some major cities. Over here is a, uh, what appears to be a, U a U.S. Army layout, yeah. I wonder what this button does. It looks like a doorbell. Ah, it operates this train. That's interesting.
And then here we have two regular trains. This button here operates the switch tower, or it should. Hmm. Then we have ZWs here. This one controls the Pennsylvania. This is one of the old Lionel sets. And the Chicago Northwestern. It's running backwards. I have no idea. Here, I'll press the direction. Well, I guess that doesn't do anything. It just makes it run backwards. I'll press the direction again. All right. Over here, we have some European trains. As well as some stuff up here. There's the rocket up there. Here's a giant bell and a fire brigade, plus a construction train, or what appears to be one anyways. Here are some good books. Down here are some of the Toy Story liners from Lionel. And speaking of Lionel, we have this whole entire layout devoted to them. We have the Blue Comet. A classic circus train. And down here are even more trains. All right, let's press this button and see what happens. There's even more trains back there. Oh, and look, there's the... Yeah, I think nothing's happening. Yeah, it looks like they don't move. That's fine. We'll just uh, take a look at the rest of this layout. That's Lionel for you. Down here we have some uh, Thomas and Friends wooden railway. There's... There's Cranky and here's another railway with Annie and Clarabelle and... Yeah, it looks like most of the trains are here. I don't know why, they just are. Over here we have a huge ass layout. Push this button to operate the police cars flash and light right there. And here is a circus train. A rather small one at that. Mickey's dining car. What the hell? All right, there it goes inside. And here comes another circus train. Here's 
Here's another treat. Looks like this button operates this tree. Let's check it out. out in Gleesville. Oh, I see what they're doing. Over here is a trolley. This button must be for the other troll. Oh, and if you look over there, you can find a live steam engine over here. It operates on either steam or compressed air. Interesting. Here's the circus train again. They have these fences here for a reason, so you can't touch them. Here's the Empire Builder's signal house. As well as some delete stuff down here. Alright, here's the inside of the signal box. Looks pretty interesting. Here's another freight train. Here we have some Lionel sets from the 70s, consisting of the Chessy System, the Blue Comet, the Southern Crescent Limited, the Wabash Cannonball, and the... Right up here, there's a running train. Ostriches inside. What? Ostriches? That's interesting. This button here controls the 
easily on Derek. And this button. Oh, wow. Controls the newspaper stand. Here's a Wayne Oak head of what's from 1957. And some more toy trains down here. Let's press this button to activate the beacon tower. There it is. Then we press this button to activate the outside train. I am amazed it doesn't derail at that speed. And now for the inside train. Here you will find Thomas, Annie, and Clearville, and I love toy trains. These orange handles should activate this Thomas train with giraffes and Bugs Bunny in the assembly scene. Well, this ZW activates this train. This one activates this Thomas. Oh, it looks like he's missing his side rods. Oh yeah, his side rods are completely gone. Alright, let's see what's over here. It's another circus train. Well, it is September, so they have circus trains everywhere, you know? Activate this button. Oops, I forgot. Alright, there goes that train. There's the Hiawatha. Here we have some different gauge differences, so to speak. I have no idea what the ZW is. It looks like it's been disassembled for a reason. So yeah. Why you don't leave batteries in your trains. That does make sense now that I think about it. Over here is a caboose stove. And over here is a Lego train set with Thomas. Press the button, and there he goes. I wonder what happens when you connect it with this. Just watch. Hang on. Controls for your engines and that kind of thing. Uh, 
All right, that, that's it. I'm giving up on you. Let's see what shooting action you can do. Okay, I guess it only goes that way. All right, let's get back to this layout over here. Oh wait, there's another layout down here. I didn't see that. This button here activates this train. The boss cannonball. And this button activates this circus train. Interesting, I'll give it that. Thomas and James. Here's James pulling trucks and two versions of Thomas with Amy and Clarabelle. There's Nemo and Dory for some reason. I don't know what they're doing here, but they're doing it. Ah, looks like they modified that Thomas train a little bit. Over here we have some pre-war trains, like the Blue Comet, and the New York Central, and uh, the Hiawatha, and all that, all that stuff. Over here is a behind-the-scenes look at the stuff they do. Over here, the horn and train buttons are on the floor. Look at this. That's interesting. What does this do? Ah, it's a saw blade. That's interesting. And this loads the barrels onto the car. And of course, it's not always successful. Let's see if it can try to pick it up, and it can't. All right, down here is some American Flyer trains. Press this button to activate. A game car? Hmm. Here we have even more unique trains. Well, I don't know what that does, but... Hmm. Oh, well. This button is not in service, but this one is. All right, let's see what we can find here. The 
upper inner loop does nothing. Here we go. That's an interesting layout. Lino down here. A short train. And a marsh train down here. Alright, this inner loop does not work. What about this one? Ah, it activates the Station Master. And over here, this button activates the crossing gate. Here's a behind the scenes the look yeah. at electric trains. That's just the bathroom. There's no trains in there. Unless you make them yourself. And over here we have an amusement park. This button activates the swing ride. There is a train down here, a park train. The scrambler. Ah! The carousel. A camera train. Just watch. Now let's watch the playback as it appears. Oh look, it's a little drive-in movie. This button activates the roller coaster. The balancing man. And the strong man. Hmm. Here's the billboard for the Ringling Brothers. The cha-cha ride. I think it's broken. Here's the gate man again. His door is broken. Just watch. Flying Dumbo. Oh yeah, they do have Dumbo up there. Here's the Ferris wheel. And the shooting gallery. I don't know, that one might not be working right now. Here's the carousel, another one. There's another swing ride. That swing down there. It's a tire swing. A horse ride. The airplane. Mini golf. The tug of war. And the fleet. Press and hold. How long? Well, 
All right, over here we have some more Lionel trains. Press the button to watch this one activate. Over here is another crossing gate. This one's broken. Oh, and this button here activates the lights. Here is Chuggington Wilson with the passenger train. Toy trains and books and stuff. Here's the gift shop over here. Here we have some Marklin trains. These engines do not run, but they are on sale. And there's even more stuff here. Here's the Lego Hogwarts Express. The Poor Express down there. This is a Z gauge layout. Press the button to activate this train. This button is unfortunately not working, but you can still see the stuff down there. There's another train down there. Here's an FAO Schwartz Marklin layout. This button activates that train. And this button activates this train. And this button activates that train. Alright, that's that layout. Now I'm going to show you one more thing. Over here is a uh, behind the scenes work in progress, you might say. Right. Press this button to activate the lights in here. Yeah. Oh, hang on, here comes one. Over here, you'll find even more surprising stuff, like a shade. The Wagon Prairie, Wings Crossing. Hmm. That's. Oh, and here we have even more stuff. These are very, 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 very small. On the opposite side, we have steam sound. This button activates this train. Super Chief. This button activates this train. And there's a diesel horn for you. Over here is another Lego layout. Specifically, the State Fair. Here is the Terminal Railway. As you can see, it's a work in progress. 
but they've done a good job so far. <laughs> That's one hell of a slow train. We'll get to it on the other side. All right. Looks like they're building a spiral. But up here we have a whole bunch more stuff. The North Star train. And some huge barges. Alright, here comes the freight train now. Over there, you can find another long ass train. It's coming. the staff point. Alright, yeah. Well it's not long as I it's not as long as I thought, but it's still pretty long. Anyways, that's pretty much the whole um tour of the museum. So I'll see you all later.